No, we fully agree. I believe that uh, the communique uh, covers all the deliberations that we had. Uh, we have reaffirmed uh, with the minister the need for us to maintain and even further strengthen the strong bonds of cooperation between our two countries. Uh, we believe that uh, there's much more that we should be doing together. We have worked very well uh, in the uh, multilateral fora uh, that we are members of. But at the bilateral level, while there is a very strong relationship, we think much more could be done. Uh, we've agreed uh, through our meeting that uh, one of the areas that we wish to really give attention to is stronger sectoral cooperation at the bilateral level. Uh, we identified sectors where we think greater collaboration is possible. Science and technology and innovation is one. Uh, another is ensuring that in combating uh, challenges such as the pandemic uh, that all our countries are confronted by at the moment, uh, we can uh, work more closely together by sharing solutions uh, and ensuring at the institutional level that our teams in the clinical sciences collaborate so that we develop Algerian and South African solutions for Africa. Uh, we stress the need for us as Africa to become stronger at creating solutions for Africa in partnership with others in the world, but independently ensuring that we have capacity to address the most intractable of problems. We also affirmed Africa's ambitions in the African Continental Free Trade Agreement and ensuring that we make that agreement work by having more products from Algeria circulating in Africa and more products from South Africa circulating on the continent as well. If we can enhance African trade, it means we increase African productivity and thus African economic growth. So we've said that uh, economic collaboration is going to be the mantra in the renewed collaboration that we have agreed. Uh, we will give attention to Algerian companies getting to know the South African business environment. Uh, we have eased the doing of business in South Africa, and we'd like Algerian companies to benefit from that. Uh, we have a one-stop center for new applicants, for company licenses, and other regulatory aspects of trade. Uh, in South Africa, and we would like to introduce our colleagues in Algeria to the support that we provide through trade and industry to make it easy for African businesses to establish uh, headquarters or plants in South Africa. In the economic sector discussions, we also agreed that we are, as African countries, very well endowed with natural resources, but that we've been careless at developing the ability to beneficiate uh, these minerals on our own shores. So we agreed that again, in technology, we're gonna look at how we can support each other to increase value addition and the production of African products in Africa, which we then trade with the rest of the world. So uh, Minister Bukadom and ourselves have set a rather ambitious agenda for ourselves. In it, we've agreed that we want to address African underdevelopment. We want to advance gender equality so women will be at the heart of what we seek to achieve. And we've agreed that a large part of our agenda will be focused on achieving peace and security on the continent and strengthening our African organization, the African Union, because if we strengthen it, it will be able to play a full role uh, in the development of our continent. So we've had excellent deliberations, and I look forward to working closely with the minister 
uh, to ensure that we achieve this ambitious agenda. Minister, if I could hand over to you. Thank you. I'm very happy uh, for the results of our consultations this morning. Uh, we have a tremendous, fantastic agenda for the future. Uh, our goal is peace, is peace in Africa, is improving first our even better our relationship, the economy, uh, trade, that's extremely important, we need that. We have the South African pole and North African pole. Uh, we have to build a stronger relationship in all the fields, bilateral, uh, especially you mentioned uh, uh, Minister, the, uh, the uh, technical, scientific, outer space, this is, this is very important. The, uh, w but we need also to work for Africa. We need a stronger Africa, a peaceful Africa, and uh, a peaced Africa, the, uh, and uh, strengthening the, uh, the institution that we have, uh, the uh, African uh, Union, the Commission. Uh, the, uh, it has to, uh, to be more involved in solving all the issues that we have in front, peace and security issues, but also development uh, in Africa. The, so we need a stronger commission, we need a stronger institution, and uh, we need to work together. And uh, especially between South Africa and Algeria, we are ready to do that. Our goal is peace, it's not something else. Of course, we're settling the issues that we have in front of us everywhere on the continent. But uh, let me uh, say also the thank you for the warm welcome for the consultations, Naledi. What we have been uh, seeing here in Pretoria and uh, this beautiful city of Pretoria, and uh, to renew with the Madiba spirit and with this spirit, uh, indeed, uh, that prevailed uh, over the extensive uh, consultations we had today, constructive con consultations that we have just concluded. Uh, we touched, as the uh, Minister has mentioned, all issues, uh, including COVID, the new challenge for everyone. And uh, I, I want to insist on the, uh, I'm really thankful to President Ramaphosa for uh, his initiative and to, uh, and uh, we, of course, we all were very attentive to his uh, speech yesterday, yesterday night, and uh, we look forward to creating this African uh, bank for the vaccines for all Africa. We need it. We need it. I'm really thankful for the president for his initiative. Algeria and South Africa worked for freedom, and we'll continue to work for the freedom of Africa, including of the freedom of the mind. We need to fulfill the legitimate aspiration for development first, but also for peace for the whole continent. I want to conclude by saying my uh, sincere congratulations to South Africa for the, upon, uh, the successful uh, completion of both the mandates, uh, the first in the Security Council, where we are extremely uh, proud of the job done in New York and on the whole world. Uh, the, uh, the tenure of South Africa was uh, fantastic, not only for South Africa, but for Africa as a whole, but also for the strong leadership of President Ramaphosa of the African Union that is uh, about to end in about uh, less than a month. So uh, it is uh, a model uh, for all those who will continue the work and uh, I hope they will be inspired by the work done by President Ramaphosa and South Africa.